All right, you low-functioning primates, listen up. Today, I'm teaching you how to force Comfy UI to describe an image for you, because clearly, thinking for yourself wasn't working out. We're building an image to prompt workflow, turning pictures into words so even your dumb ass can make prompts without having to rub two brain cells together. Make sure you already installed Comfy UI and Comfy UI Manager. If you didn't, go watch the previous videos. First, open Comfy UI, go to the Comfy UI Manager, click Custom Node Manager. Now search for Florence, authored by Kijai. The title is a hyperlink. It'll take you to the GitHub. Normally, the instructions there tell you how to install it manually. But guess what? Since you're riding the manager now like a proper evolved ape, we skip that boring shit. When you install, it asks you for a version, latest or nightly. Simple explanation even for the brain dead. Latest means the latest stable release. Polished, safe, approved by the devs. Nightly means fresh but unstable, gives you the latest features, but may have occasional bug that'll crash harder than your last relationship. We're picking nightly because we're not weak-ass babies crying about bugs. Now search for Easy Use, authored by Yolen, and install it too. Don't ask why, just do it. You're not special. Once installed, you'll need to restart. You'll see the restart drama happening in the CMD window. While this installs slower than your career progression, smash like and subscribe. It's called multitasking. Look it up. Once restart finishes, go back to your default browser and refresh the page. You can double-check in the manager if the nodes were installed. Now, we're ready for the workflow. First, you need an image. Double-click the empty space, search Load Image, and drop that node in. Now, if you're wondering, why is there already a picture loaded? That right there is the default image, and with all the AI power we've unlocked, all the billions in research, models trained for photorealism. Comfy UI gifts us with this, a kid's drawing of a girl with radar dish ears and a dress shaped like melted bubblegum sadness. Truly revolutionary. Don't worry, and we're not here to judge. So do us all a favor, load your own damn image. And let me guess, you're about to upload a girl's photo. Let's just hope it's for art and not whatever's rotting in your search history. Now search for Florence to run. This node will read your image and spit out a prompt. Next, search for download and load Florence to model, not model loader. If you pick wrong, enjoy manually downloading your own salvation later. Finally, grab Show Any. Now, fix this shitty mess of nodes however you want. Just wire them up like I do. In Florence to Run. Set task to more detailed caption because you want a prompt that doesn't read like it was typed during a seizure. Hit run. It'll take damn forever at first, why? Because it's downloading the model. You'll see the slow suffering happening in CMD. When it finishes, congrats. 
Your PC just described an image better than you ever could. Next time you hit Run, it'll be way faster, because the model's already downloaded. Now let's try that again. Swap the model to Florence 2 Flux Large. Again, it downloads first, then it'll run faster than your shitty attention span. And just like that, congratulations, you now have a working image to prompt workflow. And if you didn't listen to me earlier and picked the wrong loader node, guess what? Now you gotta install the models manually. It's fine. Now you can experience the character building exercise known as manual model installation through Git. Here's how you manually bash yourself with Git. Go to the Florence GitHub page. Pick a model. Click those three dots. Choose Clone Repository. Copy the Git clone link. Now. Go to your comfy UI folder. Models. LLM. Right click the space. Open git bash. Paste the clone command and hit enter. It'll take forever depending on your third-world-ass internet. When done, you'll see the model folder appear. Go back to your comfy UI browser, click Edit, then Refresh Node Definitions, or just press R in Comfy UI. Now you'll see the added model. And no, I'm not telling you which model is best. This isn't a review. Figure it out yourself. And that's it. You've successfully dragged yourself through installing Image to Prompt. If you somehow found this too complicated, I expected that. There's a ready-made workflow link in the description. If you still messed it up, I'm honestly impressed. It takes talent to fail this hard. Hit like if you survived. Subscribe if you want to become slightly less useless. See you on the next video.